Hey, sneakers, back in the house, yes. We're house in the back, back in the house, back house, in house, back in. Today we have the new version of Manjaro for you, but this one was the LXD version, yeah, LXD version. I don't know if you've been looking on the mirrors, there's been a lot of the release candidates come out for the Community Edition, so you've got E17, Naomi, and all that, all out now, you can go and download them and play with. <clears throat> Unfortunately, I've got the E17 version, it don't like playing with me, it don't want to come out to play, no, it goes on installation. So we just go down and we got the old LXDE version. Now as you can see it's a nice clean interface, you don't get no clunky like you did with the old XFC version. But again if you're using LXDE and you went nice and clean, you don't want clunky, do you know? Clunky and clunky off, if you know what I mean. So, what can I show you? Well, not too much really, because there's not much here, but I'll just give you a quick look around and you can see what I mean. Installation took around about seven and a half minutes, okay, from start to finish, and it runs hunkily of the bleeding dory, as you can see. Right, down here we have, as you can see, our exit menu, so log out, shut down, reboot, and all that, but we'll cancel that, thank you very much. Time and date is here, as you can see, it's today. All my updates are up to date, I've updated the whole system because I've actually installed it, by the way. <clears throat> Here's my Ethernet connection, my volume, so we'll turn it, turn up, turn up, turn up. And there's my network, and down here I've got me what my CPU's doing, which is not too much at the moment, as you can see. Well, it's nothing really when you come in. Anyway, we've got our two menu, sorry, our two desktops menus. Start just at my dinner, sorry, menu, you know what I'm saying? That's there, okay, we'll show desktops. Midori is your browser of choice here, so we'll open Midori up for you. If he wants to open up from that shortcut. There we go, it was a moment. Now, Midori's got better than it was before. When it first came out, it was really good, then it went really bad, now it's really good again, so that's super duper. Now we can download lots of different ones, so we can do the community releases, we're going to go here and show you quickly before we do anything else. Oh yeah, baby, and all that. Okay. Right, here we have the LXD Mates and E17s, okay? You can download them here, no big deal. Or you can get the latest XFC version, 64-bit. 1.2 gigabytes, which isn't too bad really. Most of them are going onto DVDs now. Some try to keep the CDs, but like if you want everything on there, you can't do it really, can you? But look, you can download them all from here, so it's all nicey nicey. That's enough of that, okay. Well, what do we get in our menu? Okay, under accessory, bear in mind it's LXDE, you ain't gonna get a lot. You get an archive manager, catfish for file searching, PC man file manager, calculator, get it, HP device manager, an image viewer, and LX terminal, okay. Under graphics, we get just simple scan. Oh, it's really, really quick. Simple scan and Gimpage. So we'll open Gimpage up. It's Gimpage 2.8 and it does what it says on the tin. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Yum, yum, caramel. Lovely. And there we go. Lovely. You can make it single screen if you want to. And I know I'll go on about it every time I open it up. But no, that's what a lot of people want 2.4 is to have a single screen. I don't actually mind just all the other bits and bobs because I, you know, my screen's reasonably large. Well, I can't wait to buy a new one. Thank you. Okay, so goodbye. Anyway, under internet, we got SSH server browser. Yeah, yeah, you know what you want to do with that. Midori and Midori private browsing, just in case you want to go and look at some naughty things. Pigeon, remote desktop access, or viewer should I say, and Slifed for your mail. Under office, you just get Abbey Word and G Numeric. Now, I'm going to open Abbey Word up for a simple reason. Of, bloody hell, that was quick. Did you see that? Just to see what version it is. And they are keeping to 286 because it is the most stable version. 292, some people are still having problems with it, okay? Yeah, yeah, baby, you know what I'm saying? And of course, Gene America is there. You can get the full office suite if you want to, and I'll show you how to do that in a minute, okay? Yeah, the QT stuff and JDK stuff. Under sound and video, you just get an audio mixer, a music player, just a music player, another mixer, a QT testing utility, blah, 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 and SM player for videos. Might not all work unless you get all the stream map codecs, if you know what I mean. Under system tools, okay, I'll start at the bottom. Open our task manager up, shall we? And as you can see, it's not using a lot of RAM, is it? And it's not using a lot of CPU. So I'm not too worried about that, but that's there for you to use if you want to. But to be honest, if you if you want an art space system on an older machine, okay, not too old, but on an older machine, older-ish, and it'll be lightning fast, this is going to be it for you. Anyway, at the system tools. Software updater, we've also got the icon on the bottom bar there. Manager printing, G parted is here. Deconf editor, configure LXDM, yeah, you can do that if you want to. Add and remove software, okay. This is 
PC Mac, I can't remember. Oh, Pac, pa Mac, pa Mac, pa Mac. Sounds like a chocolate bar, doesn't it? And basically from here, you can actually install whatever you like. So for instance, if I put open shot in, it will be here. There we go. There it is. And you just highlight it, it tells you all the bits and bobs it needs. Now it only takes 19 megs to download, so you know what I'm gonna do? Because I'm feeling really nice and I like you. I'm gonna apply that and we're gonna apply it. So we've got click apply. Yeah, we'll have Python 2, and it'll probably go bang now, you watch. Oh, that do, yeah, we'll click OK at that. I'll just click OK at everything, man, yeah. Just click, just clicky, click it. Oh, and it wants me password. Right, and in theory, oh, it's downloading 56 meg, okay, all the extra bits and bobs I had to do there. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to move that up there while it's doing that. Now, while it's doing that, I'm going to come to our menu again, and we'll quickly go to Preferences. Get your screensaver preferences there, your print settings, preferred applications. It's quite a stripped back and not basic LXD menu, really. Some of them are a bit mixed up, but this one's kept it okay, dokely. Yeah. Network connections, your monitor settings, your main menu editor, your firewall builder, firewall builder, blah, blah, blah. firewall builder, desktop preferences. I'm not even any beer. God, I can't believe it. Customised look and feel of LXD, that's a standard one. Flash player, it seems, is as standard as well, but we'll have a quick look at that in a momento once it's finished installing all that stuff, which shouldn't take too long. But that's basically the whole system. Now, it fits on a CD, so that's even better. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And if you like this sort of thing, nice and quick, you know, no, no icons on a desktop, you just want to get your work done, no mucking about, this is it for you. But I do understand that some of you use Linux as a, a hobby system just for fun well yes and no you can do you might not want an xds when you want your bells and whistles but if you want a system that works continually like this one that's the baby for you oh yeah so in theory that should be in my menu now or i may have to restart which i'm not going to bother doing i don't think we're going to have to sad nvidia mm, it's there should I see if it opens dun, 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 do da do da that's all right wasn't it yeah now please remember if you do install open shop You'll have to install a version of Blender as well, if it's 256A, which you should really have now. And you have to link it to Blender, to, to OpenShot, to get your animated titles. Otherwise, it ain't gonna work, okay? It don't work. Well, you won't make it animated titles, but you'll be able to edit your videos, okay? Lovely. Right, anyway, Manjaro LXDE, lovely community edition, super of the duper. Blimey, I really like it. 95% sneaky Linux out. I see that. Bye-bye.